about to leave Already packing, come with me I'm not really asking We'll get away to a place where we don't know Warm welcome, guys, back to the uh, east south uh, coastal tour of the UK. Uh, we've just crossed the border of Suffolk, and we are now in glorious Essex. Uh, lovely, jubbly. Uh, uh, this is as far as I've been. I've not been this far in uh, an RV anyway. I might have been here many, many years ago, but uh, uh, we're on our route towards the uh, Clacton uh, down that way, guys. It's supposed to be a no no for camper vans, but. Uh, We'll sort it out. Anyway, let's crack on. Lovely sunshine. Richie Sky. Oh, another lovely camp. Uh, beautiful, guys. Absolutely stunning. Uh, time for some summer loving. Some summer loving and some summer food. Look at that. Crusty, fresh soda bread from the village I was at last. Handmade coleslaw. Locally made pork pie. A bit of cranberry cheese, strawberries and cream for afterwards. And we love summer. No cooking, no power, nice and cheap. In the van anyway. Lovely jubbly hey, sky. Hey sky, lovely, we're gonna enjoy this. The sun is starting to set, absolutely stunning. Guys, guys, what a stunning sunset over the Star Valley. The Star Estuary, here in my first night in Essex. How stunning is that? I did a time lapse as well. And the sky is just on fire. Just out for an evening walk, you can barely see me there, guys. Look at that. Absolutely stunning. I mean, it's a roadside park up, guys, uh, here in Essex, but uh, it's bloody lovely just coming into the lights of Christine. Absolutely stunning. Oh, you can see me now. Look at that. Is that not epic, guys? What a lovely way to spend your evening, eh? Have a good one, guys. All right, guys, where are we? Bright and early. Uh, it's about uh, five past eight in the morning. I've been up at about so uh, add some cereals lovely jubbly we're down here at uh, in Essex now as you know uh, it's a place called Misty and um, it's a the it's part of the River Stour the Stour Estuary it's an area of outstanding natural beauty so uh, we're going to have a little peep out see what it's all about lovely jubbly uh, we've got Misty to the right and Manning Tree to the left two little towns and there's lots of uh, this ones and whatever here and we're going to have a move shall we we're going to have a little look around see what it's all about uh, so we, it's, it's, on a, it's on it's a roadside park up so there's a few cars in the daytime doesn't bother me at all guys uh, around about it went quiet around about half 10 11 o'clock last night and it was peaceful lovely peaceful nice sleep nice and straight nice and level 
I've got a bin somewhere to walk the dog as well, so lovely. But in the daytime, there are a few cars. That might not be for everyone, but it doesn't bother me, guys. I love it. The upside is they just bumped into my guitar. I love it, absolutely love it. Um, you know, being a van life, I park up anywhere, really. Lovely job, Link, and look at that uh, for a morning view. The tide's out at the moment, guys. Beautiful, eh? And my lovely little sky there. Ready for a walk? You ready for a walk? You gonna go walkies? <laughs> Right guys, let's go and see what Mistley, what a lovely name, Mistley and Manning Tree is all about on the Star Estuary here in Essex. Lovely. Right guys, there's our lovely street park up, beautiful, on the side of the road, don't bother me, but look at the views guys, look at the views, absolutely stunning, what a lovely area, uh, so we're in Essex now. Say the roads, there's a few cars on the roads. We've got a lovely church steeple up there and the swans in the field. Right, let's crack on. Lovely early morning blue skies this morning. There's thousands of birds out there. This is the Missley Walls, guys, stretching from Manning Tree down to Missley Towers. It's common land looked after by the Missley Parish Council. The mud flats are vital wildlife habitat, spring and autumn. Missley Towers is just up the road, remains of an unconventional church designed by the great architect Robert Adam. Uh, the actual bridge that we're on, guys, is um, named after the Witch Finder General. We've mentioned him a few times in Scotland, who once lived in Missley. Lovely, lovely birds. There's a train track on the other side of the estuary there. Lovely. Apparently there's lots and lots of uh, wild swans here when the tide comes in. Lovely, misty bay. Mistly bay, lovely. Place. This is so a shame it's on a, a road, uh, so much traffic, but uh, it's absolutely beautiful, guys. Google Earth again, guys. Google Earth again. Beautiful. Right, we'll crack on. Come on, Sky. What are you doing? What are you doing? Where is she? Where is she? There she is. Lovely little morning walk. Cracking, guys. Oh, what a lovely morning! Well, these are the uh, Mistley Towers, guys. All that remains of a church from 1735, the entrance to the church. It was remodeled by Rod Robert Adam in 1776. How amazing, eh? There used to be a church standing here, and this was the entrance to the church. It was demolished in uh, 1870, and a new church was built further up the road. Missley Towers. Wow, what a church that must have been, eh? Amazing. up from Missley Towers guys down this country line. It's a beautiful church there. We're going to have a look at that. What a lovely steeple. What a lovely church this is. I don't think it's that old. 
It's beautiful. Lovely oak wooden Lovely gates. Steeple. This is St Mary and St Michael of Missley and Manning Tree Guys Parish. It's closed, I'm afraid, so we can't go in. Certainly a very impressive church, guys. It's beautiful. All right, we found a way in. Go and have a look, shall we? Beautiful gardens. All right, we've got the sky tied up there. Let's go. down the aisle. I remember walking down the aisle with Christine uh, in the early 70s. Wow. What a beautiful church, eh? What a stunning church. Glorious. Right. Let's go and see what Sky's doing, eh? She's out there. <laughs> beautiful, eh? There you go guys, Michelin and Manning Tree, lovely church. That's lovely, I love looking around churches, especially the older churches. That's, that was a lovely church that was. Must have been quite a well-to-do parish in the past, Michelin. Must have had some money, the older <laughs> church. Right guys, we'll crack on to the village.
Misley Village guys, just up from Misley Towers. We've got a couple of shops, a pub, lovely jubbly, lovely quayside, quayside here. here. What a lovely uh, swan in the uh, little pond there. That's pretty. It's like a quayside uh, harbour here, Misley Quayside. I'm going to have a mood shake. Well, even though Misley's a bit run down now, guys, it used to be a major, major seaport back in the day, 17th, 18th century, with massive big corn mills and grain buildings everywhere. Uh, they even did shipbuilding back here in the day, but uh, no longer. It's all days gone by, I'm afraid, for this uh, little town. It's still a pretty little town. Uh, so there's not a lot here in Misley, but uh, it's worth a, a little meander. Right, we'll go up to uh, Manning Tree now. I think there's a lot more at Manning Tree. We'll go and see what they take about, guys. Lovely, lovely Missley. What a lovely name, eh? Nice name, anyway. This is Hopping's Bridge, guys, named after Matthew Hopkins, who was the 17th century Witchfinder General. We've talked about him many times in my tours, guys. What a beautiful lake. Right, we're a few miles past Christine now, uh, further up the other way, guys, and we're in the little town of uh, Manning Tree, which I believe in uh, ancient words means many trees. The home of Matthew Hopkins there. The witch finder general uh, it's a map of the uh, town there guys and we're just by the harbour side this is the quayside just at the bottom of the town it's got a lower to bit and an upper town it's got a lovely beach uh, i believe this is a homemade beach man-made beach uh, for the locals uh, to have their picnics and whatever lovely it is beautiful all gardens everywhere as well guys Lovely flowers, well looked after. Ah, blimey, it is hot again today. I've lost the sound on this bloody track for some reason. My white mic went off, so um, I'm talking over myself here, guys. <laughs> uh, just sat on the golden sandy beach. It's absolutely lovely. You've got pubs behind us and restaurants, and um, it's lovely. A lovely place to have the day or to camp up where I am. There's also a caravan uh, on the uh, road where I am, uh, selling sandwiches and hot seas and lovely. So uh, I may have a go at that later. Just looking around the uh, boat yard here at Manning Tree. Looking out to the uh, Stower Estuary there. Uh, it's low tide at the moment, but uh, it's a beautiful day. Absolutely beautiful. Uh, we're walking up to the upper town now. Uh, some lovely cottages up here, guys. Quite narrow roads as well, especially coming up to the top town. Uh, this is the top town of Manning Tree. As you can see it's very bloody narrow. There's a buzz coming. Whoops. That's a bit tight get, getting through there, blimey. It's just one way traffic there. Double squeeze through, boy. <laughs> lovely. Yeah, there's nice restaurants and charity shops. Oh, we love a charity shop. I couldn't live without my charity shops. It's got a nice little square up the top, and you've got Tesco's and a post office and general stores. There's a nice little walk through alleyways here in the uh, square at the top of the village, which is lovely. Oh, the smell of Chinese, guys. It's making me salivate. That smells absolutely delicious. Uh, we're just coming out at the top now. There's a nice little restaurant there, lovely. Lovely job, lovely. Somewhere to sit and chat away the day over a nice cup of coffee. Or a pint of Guinness. Oh, that looks quite old, that building there. A nice pint of Guinness sat by the seaside. Um, you know, I'm usually into the remote skies. I don't mind these busy places now and again, but uh, only now and again. And that's the main square there. That's the uh, library at uh, Manning Tree, looking back up towards the town. There we go, guys. I think that'll do on this unusual. Design your own casks and coffins. Bling up your coffin. Blimey, O'Reilly. Look at him, he seems a happy chap there, blinging up people's coffins. Oh dear, whatever turns you on, any. 
blinged up bloody coffin fish and chips yeah there's a fish and chip shop as well a lovely square plenty of pubs right walking back now there's loads of places guys loads of places to park there's about a mile and a half stretch between manning tree and uh Mistley. a mile and a half stretch along the stower estuary beautiful views uh, we've got a caravan here selling hot sandwiches and tea so if that's your bag, but uh, we're on a budget. We can't do that, guys. We'll get back to the van. Hi, Sky. How you doing, Bobby? You all right? You all right? You enjoyed your walk? We went for about three, four miles, I think. Uh, up and down this uh, lovely uh, road uh, where we camped. Beautiful. Down to uh, Mistley and up to uh, the village to the left as well. Uh, it's about 12 o'clock now. I think we've been out since about 8 o'clock this morning. But so we've had some breakfast anyway. Lovely here, the sun's shining again. Look at the sunshine out there, guys. Absolutely beautiful. The tide is out at the moment. Uh, I may get the drone up uh, later, guys. And uh, uh, it's nice to have a bit of drone footage of the area we're in, which is nice. Uh, uh, when I left uh, Albra, uh, I had quite a few people come to meet me. Uh, the ones that I can remember, uh, I think, uh, Adrian uh, from Van Scram. How you doing, Adrian? It's lovely to meet you and your lovely mum. Like me, Adrian's mum. They, they go, they, he's building a van at the moment, but they was in a small micro van. And um, Adrian's mum is 90, 99, I think, and she's still going out, out in the van with him. Absolutely amazing. So it just shows you guys it can be done. I mean, my poor mum made it to 94. As you know, she passed recently. But uh, Adrian's mum, 99, she looks fit as a fiddle. She could certainly chase me around the bloody trees, I tell you. So lovely to meet you, Adrian, and your lovely mummy. That was lovely. And uh, we also met um, Motorhome Tours as well. Uh, I'm sorry, I can't remember your, your name. Um, I think it's a Scottish uh, uh, Japanese uh, wife in their van. They tour all over the world, though, those two do. So lovely to meet you two guys as well. And um, hopefully we'll meet you again on the road. You have safe travels, guys. There's a couple of cars on the road at the moment. I've just had a lovely bacon and egg sandwich. Hey, Sky, you've had your breakfast? Right, uh, what I'm going to do, I'll say I'll pop the drone up for you to show you this beautiful area we're in. It's quite close to the main towns here in Essex, but uh, it's not quite the wilds that we're used to, guys. But uh, on this run, this south coast run, we're not going to get wild locations like in Scotland, but we'll be back there in the autumn up in Scotland. My, my lovely winter home. Right, so uh, we'll get the drone up uh, to say thanks for you and guys, thanks for watching and everything, all the good stuff.
bit of coffee thoughts as well guys absolutely amazing keeps me uh, and this little madam happy me with a pint and sky with a treat uh, uh, absolutely lovely guys beautiful so thanks for that thanks for all your comments and all your lovely kind words as well and all your views share the channel subscribe if you haven't subscribed already guys don't forget a lot of people think subscribe means you have to pay you don't it's all free on youtube you can watch everything i'm doing all these videos guys i think there's nearly 500 in my playlist so uh, if you want to binge watch you got a few days watching there if you want to watch this for uh, <laughs> for 500 bloody videos but stunning eh bloody lovely Okay, guys, so I'll leave it there. Lovely job, Lee, uh, for this part of the Essex. So uh, we'll find another camp. We'll have a look at Tarridge somewhere there. And we'll leave this lovely camp here at Mistley. Lovely place. Lovely camp. See, just off the road, guys. Lovely spot. Catch you later. Ta-da! <laughs>